what's going on everybody it is friday morning it's uh uh it's been a it's black friday <laughs> there you go black friday let's go with that it's been a very very busy week as y'all know we raced last weekend at deep south had a great time had to get home get everything cleaned up go back to work on the 2018 car which is what we're bringing to the dome we are leaving monday so there was a whole bunch of work to be done we've had all hands on deck chase rocky charles myself avery adrian everybody's been working uh chase has a a trailer here this is actually kevin cumby's trailer chase has a body job to do when we get home with that thing on that so uh monday just like any other monday you know we we raced last sunday so when we got home monday we were unloading and still excited about winning the race and looking at the trophy in the daylight and seeing what we got and talking about things and chase told me he said i told him i said man i'm exhausted this has been a heck of a year very thankful for it but i'm wore down and he said me too but he said i want to sit down and just reminisce and look at things and talk about things but he said i can't i gotta keep digging and he pointed at a one of his cardboard checks on the wall and he said you see that right there he said i worked harder that week on my race car than i've ever worked in my life and he said i won that he said you see that one he said it was why not fall classic he said i worked harder that week on my car and getting drake's car ready and i won that he said this weekend worked my butt off won that he said i'm going to win the dome and i was like hey i get it i'm with you that's what i want to do but uh he's driven he's very driven and that's what it takes you know uh chase had a choice when he graduated college to go to work a regular eight to five job whatever you want to call it uh or put in a hundred percent into racing and, and go for it and see if he can make a living off of it and that's what he's trying to do and he's very motivated he's uh i mean i think doing very well i mean obviously the money's not that great because you're spending a lot more than what you're making but he is putting in the work and he is getting people behind him with products and sponsorships and that helps out a ton but uh right now we're getting ready for the dome and you know he's in the shop before anybody and he's in he, he's the last one to leave the shop every night you know i've been out here at 11 11 30 at night and he's out here getting it and that's what it takes man he's a hard worker and that's why anytime he uh he puts it in victory lane you know I i'm proud of him because i know how hard he's working to get there so uh, i hope he just keeps pushing i hope he uh i hope it just keeps uh happening the way it is man we have been blessed we got a lot of great people behind us that's helping all this come together and uh we're just going to keep digging, doing what we're doing. So I'm going to walk in here now. I'm fixing to pull the engine out of the show pony, which is right here. So I'm pulling the engine out of this one. This is the Mullins. I'm taking it out today and uh, probably have some help here in a little bit, but I'm going to get going on it. We're pulling it out, and it is going with us in the trailer to the dome. Hopefully we don't need it, but if we do, it'll be there. Looks like somebody's working on their, uh, yeah, got somebody's got a mess, he said. But the great thing about this wrap right here, you can't mess it up. It's a tore up mess from the get go. So he's, he's stressing out over little things. We're down to the wire on getting ready. We really need to have this thing in the trailer and we're getting there. So, uh, it's going to have some really cool features of it. For those of y'all that don't understand what's going on, this was the first wrap right here that uh, Jeremy Item with Lookout Graphics ever did for us. And everything else going on this car is a, a what they call it, a compilation of, of all of the wraps put together. So 
I think it's a cool idea, or we thought it was a cool idea to come together like this. So that's what we're working on, is putting all the wraps together on one car, kind of like a weekend warrior, I think is what Chase is calling it. Uh, hey, I don't know what, he, what all he's got going on over there. Looks, looks like he's trying to tear the door off before we get there. But anyway, he's going for a weekend warrior look. Should have no trouble spotting the car on the track because it's going to look like a junkyard dog. And that's what we're, uh, that was the look we were going for. When we broke this out, it, this is a bad to the bone wrap, but I think everybody thought this was our dome wrap. Well, surprise, we got shirts made. We got, we're, we're going in hard to the dome. He's ordered more shirts than he's ever had in his life because everybody keeps telling us how big of an event this is. And we're very excited about it. So we are going big all the way and we're excited. So I've talked enough this morning, time to get to work. He's been getting after it. Got to pull this engine. He's going to continue putting the wrap on. Uh, I think Charles will be here in a little bit and uh, we got to go. We got to get this thing in the trail. So here we go. All right, so as I'm pulling this engine out right here, I used the product that we got a while back that we hadn't used it's from jr1 motorsports they are the same ones that made this really cool carb cover for us uh mr vernon hill jr he made these right here for 20 bucks their uh exhaust port covers comes with the bolts nice little uh piece right there to protect your engine while you got it in the trailer for transport or putting it up for the season or whatever like i said i think it's 1999 uh the whole nine yards so it's real real nice little product and this is the uh the latest on what's going on over here you look stressed out it's just it's it's different <laughs> well you knew that i knew it Hey, we ought to put Tanner Mullins' door on. You think Ruby yeah, and mine? It matched. Yeah. Yeah, we got Tanner's door here that we bought for Ruby when we was up in uh, Oklahoma. We could stick that bad boy on there, go out and run over people and act like it wasn't us. <laughs> yeah, I think it looks really cool, buddy. Cool deal. All right, well, we'll check in later. So we have our uh, setup guy over here, and he just put the tune on the on our dome car. But uh, me. yeah, 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 no, no, yeah. this is CHC right here. This well, is the when I saw y'all was going down there, I knew I needed to come by. I mean, you look pretty de decent at Deep South, but you're just off just a little bit. So I figured I'd better come out here and help you out. So I think we got this thing dialed in pretty good. Got it covered up so nobody can see it. Mm -hmm. But uh, you know, we we ready for um, the dome. But most importantly, we're ready for an enduro race. What do you think about the enduro? I'm man? excited what? about that. That's uh, New Year's Eve, 200 laps. 200 laps. 100 the correct way and 100 the opposite way. And it's run what you brung, ain't it? Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> you don't hurt it. I mean, we got a tech man. If you get oh, there, you we make go. it. You make here it. Oh, but, uh, oh, oh. <laughs> well, then we better lock the shop yeah. door. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, keep that door shut. Yeah, Chase. don't let him in there. To see what we got mm -hmm. in there on the rack. But anyway, Chase Holland's going to be running in the uh, enduro race at the US MTS racing. And, uh, <laughs> That's news to me. Yeah, uh, me too. Uh, what's the name of it? going to be <laughs> Oh, you're not driving? No, Bo no. Trotter's driving. Bubba Trotter's driving. Yeah, okay. Bubba Trotter's Why are you driving. not driving? I'm a spotter. I'm going to okay. sit up in the grandstands with my headset. Mm -mm. I'm so going to be <laughs> outside. So, so last year, Spencer uh, Spencer had Doug Todd riding with him, and he was had it on race pass. <laughs> he was looking at that time, <laughs> time trying to see who was going oh, on. Man. Well, uh, I thought you was going to race, man. What's, I mean, is there a feature in another car? Possibly later on, but not this year. Let's, make a, we got Let's make a deal right now. Oh, no. I mean, we got plenty of time. Go ahead. Day. If you make the show at the dome, Chase makes the show at the dome, you buy another car for Euro race, Chase drives. It's a deal. He's shaking his head. Uh, he said a deal right there now. It's a deal. Come on now. We may we may get another car, but I don't uh, know. If I'm we don't need no maid now. What are we gonna do? I don't know. How about if we Thank win you. the dome? Let's Listen. go there. If we can uh, win I, the dome. I can't sit here and say that I'm gonna put mama's baby boy in a car without mama saying it's okay to put her baby boy in I already talked to her. Oh. Yeah, she, I talked the other day, she said, cool. Go she, did, she said she was ready, so, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> but anyway, y'all come, uh, they, Hollis gonna have a car to Enduro race, y'all come back there and see them. Yep. Uh, we got this thing headed to the dome, we got 
If y'all need some numbers off of it, call me. And uh, if you're not going to Dome, if you're going to Dome, I can't share with you. How but much? Anyway. How much for you to share information? Well, it's going to be different for each individual. Okay. <laughs> What's you working on under my car? Oh, yeah, I'm trying to get you there for the Dome. Okay. You're a little bit off right here. How far? Ah, uh, we don't need a video yet. We don't need to put okay. that video. Okay. But, uh, as long as you get it dialed. I think I might get you. Yeah, it should be good now. That's what I was uh, doing wrong. He's going out of, out of cup, and I usually go cup to cup. Well, you know, uh, and that one's a little different where y'all been, <laughs> okay. so we should be pretty good. I need to check his front end up here one second. All right. And, uh, grab it, take a on that side. Oh, yeah. To the brake or what? Huh? How far yeah, is it? Yes, that's right there. It should be good right there. All right, everything looks good. Look. Everything looks good. Uh, what? I'll just keep you out this 45 now. And uh, I do on track services as well, not just in the shop. So we will be at the dome. If y'all need anything, let me know. Y'all had that trout fish driving for you that one time. What was his name? <laughs> Trout fish. What was that boy's name? It wouldn't take my advice. <laughs> Drake, uh, Drake Trout. Man. Yeah, a Drake Trout fish. I tried to tell him about to set up over that why not. He thought I was just a damn drunk because I had a little cold <laughs> beer in my hand. But uh, you saw what the 45 did up here. Just pay attention to it from now, Trout Fish. And uh, you coming to the dome? He, he, he is. is. He's coming. All right, I'm going to get your name right because you probably like me calling you Trout <laughs> Fish. But anyway, we'll see you at the dome. If y'all need help, holler at between now and then. I got a couple more cars to check. But uh, just give me a holler. Thanks. There you go. Johnny Brady, set up guru. What's going on here? Oh, final, final touches. Road to the dome, huh? Road to the dome. It's really easy. Been... Really nothing to it. Piece of cake, man. Took, took two days at the most. Yeah. Avery asked me what the most stressful race of this season has been for me, and I didn't have an answer, but I've got one now. This, this one. has been the this most one. stressful. I'm not going to tighten mine. We're, we are going prepared for the car to beat our track, for the track to beat our car up. So we have checked, triple checked, and quadruple checked everything, and that's not saying nothing can't happen. But we have been all over this thing, every one of us, over and over and over. And right now it is Saturday, somewhere around lunchtime probably. And we're still not in the trailer, but we're getting there. Uh, this thing is wild. For those of y'all that don't know, I know a lot of you know exactly what this is and what this means. This is a roof that we built early in the season. My dad passed away January 31st of this year, right when we got home from East Bay to Monday morning after we got home. I didn't even get to see him, and uh, he passed away. And unexpectedly, it's been really tough. We did a, a memorial wrap for him in honor of him. It was an 07 car, and this actual roof, Chase and Rocky built this roof, and we brought it to the funeral home. And it was up on display in the funeral home, and that's what all these signatures are. This is all the family and friends that everybody signed and, and wrote their farewells and everything. Uh, we put it on the car. We went racing with it. Uh, we won at Hattiesburg with it. We won at Deep South with it. We won quite a few races. We pulled it off, went back to our other stuff with our, with our uh, 07 and the 45. There's the original body up there that was on with the roof so anyway it's been an emotional year for me personally uh it's been a great year we we've, we've uh met a lot of goals this year that chase and i talked early on in the year you know what what was our goals early on and our goals were to win every local big race down this way and everyone that we registered in we did it and uh took a lot of work from guys like these and a lot of other guys uh it, it takes a lot it takes a lot of really good sponsors to make all this come together you know i mean we have been blessed all of these guys just just 
everybody, so many people, so many fans that have helped us get where we are. So this is kind of the uh, finale is what I'm going to call it. Uh, we may crash out and blow the motor on the first lap and, you know, fix it and blow a motor to the next night. But we put everything we got into it. We're going to the dome knowing that we may come home with nothing left, and we're okay with that. So uh, we're going to have a good time. We're bringing a lot of folks with us. We got a lot of people coming to meet us for the first time, and I'm excited about that. I've never raced inside before. So that all be pretty neat. But they're doing the final touches. We got the trailers loaded up. Charles and Rocky's been bowed up working on this trailer, on this trailer. Uh, there's, this is different than anything we ever done because you can't, you can't have the uh, side by side. You can't have a generator. You can't have fuel. You're only allowed three five gallon jugs of fuel and they confiscate it when you get there. And I get it, there's a lot of things because we're inside a building and you know a lot of stuff can happen and they have to take control of everything and I get it. But it just takes a lot more you Whoa, know, preparations to get everything ready. So, so that's where we're at. Uh, very excited and uh, we are we're almost in the trailer, so here we go. short so we robbed the panel off of that one and put on here because that one's pretty special to us and we want to make sure that was riding with us this weekend so there's that we ready to go in the hole yet We're close, close. Got some heat in this thing. Like sounding good. Got Big Bird under the hood of this thing. Got the Mullins in the trailer over there. Hopefully we don't need it. It's almost time. Wonder what them other racers are gonna think when this junky thing pulls up by them on the racetrack. Huh? They probably gonna let off the gas and get out the way. I'm scared you gonna run over them with this turd. <laughs> they look like a turd the most. I, I know that this, all of this means a lot to us and this is our, what we call the weekend warrior wrap. So I'm excited about it. We, we made, we're actually ahead of the game. We made shirts and all for this wrap. <laughs> yeah. 
So there you go. We're working on the shirts for the wrap back there because that was kind of a, a surprise deal right there. We were going to make that wrap for Ted and Shannon and uh, we were just going to run it one time. And now I think the census is in. I believe this is going to be the USMTS 2023 wrap right here. So I like it. I like it a lot. So, so that's that. Oh, I know what I need to be working on. Putting this camera down, getting to work. What we've been looking for. See y'all in St. Louis.